Hello, my name is Dr. James Calder, and I'm a physician at Zurich Medical. Zurich Medical is a dedicated hair transplant practice based in California, and I've been affiliated with them for a total of over seven years now, over two periods of time, and very happy to recently again affiliate with Dr. Zurich and embark on today's new challenges, new discoveries, and new technologies for hair transplant surgery. My training and background dates some 35 years in total, now over half of it dedicated to the practice of hair transplant surgery. At the time when I first discovered and became involved with hair transplantation, the practice and specialty had evolved to the point where new technologies were being incorporated. New technologies at that time included the use of microscopes to more precisely dissect the hair and smaller instrumentation to facilitate the placement of more hair within a given area. We to roll them out to the public as they become available to us here at Zurich Medical. A lot of people visiting Zurich Medical pose this question to the physicians. What type of hair transplant surgery do you perform? We at Zurich Medical are proud to offer both follicular unit strip surgery and follicular unit excision or FUE hair transplantation. In 2020, the world of hair transplantation practice is being largely segregated into two camps, practices that perform only strip surgery and practices that perform only FUE surgery. It is very clear to dedicated hair transplant practitioners that a combination of both of these techniques is vital to be able to offer the best option to all of our patients. Not one technique, no one technique is suited for every individual. Similarly, a particular technique may be used in combination with the other over time to achieve optimal results. Today at Zurich Medical, physicians provide the patients with the harvesting, whether it be done with FUSS or strip harvesting or follicular unit extraction. This affords the patient the confidence that the most learned provider in the practice is making the determination as to how to manage the donor hair. The good news for the patient is that hair transplants do in fact last nearly forever. A hair transplant performed in 2020 on a young individual should be with that person, be it he or she, for their entire life. Will I need more than one procedure to satisfy my needs? Now that is not to say that one recovers all of the hair lost by a single procedure, and hence the possibility for an additional procedure either to treat the same area and develop higher density or to extend treatment into an area newly involved with hair loss is a reality and a possibility. In closing, I'd like to thank you today for viewing our video, hoping that you find it educational and entertaining, and hoping further that you will come and visit us here at Zurich Medical for an expert consultation and assistance in your first step in managing your hair loss.